Now, Korea is being blanketed by a thick layer of fine dust particles from China. Experts are advising people to wear masks until the worst has blown over. Arirang News, Kim Hyun Bin reports. The Seoul city government issued a dust warning for the first time this year as dust levels went far over 85 micrograms per cubic meter for two consecutive hours. At 4 p.m. on Thursday, a level of 93 micrograms of dust was detected for every cubic meter and went even as high as 166 micrograms. A cloud of smog and toxic dust have covered most of the nation since early this week, with average concentration levels that are two to three times higher than normal. On Wednesday, particulate dust levels in Seoul reached nearly 200 micrograms per cubic meter, nearly four times the amount observed on a normal day. That's well beyond the precautionary level of 120 micrograms per cubic meter set by the National Institute of Environmental Research. It's also more than seven times the level recommended by the World Health Organization, which has a standard of 25 micrograms per cubic meter. In the southern industrial town of Pohang, dust levels reached nearly 300 micrograms per cubic meter on Wednesday, forcing the city to issue a preliminary dust warning for the first time this year. But there's good news on the horizon. Dust concentration levels are expected to decline gradually starting Thursday. The concentration may be high in the morning in Seoul and Chungcheongdo because of the fine particle pollution coming from China. But the daily average is expected to return to normal today. The dust contains toxic pollutants, including heavy metals and bacteria. And health experts advise wearing a mask with a dust filter and avoid being outdoors at dawn when dust levels are at their peak. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.